are just about to get underway with a TV title match. It's a one fall 15 minute time limit. You know, this is for the TV title. The winner of this match uh, wins the TV title. And the, the champion is in the ring right now. Leaping Lanny. We're waiting for his opponent. We're waiting for his opponent. And we hear some shouting, and it's none other than Tez Watley, the U.S. heavyweight champion. Tez Watley, of course, is assisted by his manager, Speed Manson. Okay, we're ready to go. The wrestlers have been introduced. Tez Watley is from Chattanooga, weighs in at 230 pounds, and Leaping Lanny from Amarillo at 225, and we're ready to get underway. Exhibiting the belt, the winner of the match gets this belt. Right at the very start of the match, at the very start of the match, come on, man, you know what to do. Speed Manson is on the outside of the ring, and he, of course, standing right here, man, watching this match. He seems to be cheating a little bit there. I don't know, man. I'm just sort of checking this. I got a lot of men on my side, man. You know, the defiant one's big. The animal, man, you know, he's absolutely crazy, man. You know, we might need chains to keep him away from people, even keep him away from you, man. You know, as you're hearing a few comments from Speed Manson, who's the manager of Pez Watley, also manages other wrestlers. Thank you. A lot of action here as Pez Wadley hanging on to that left arm of Leaping Lanny, but Lanny spins around, hooks the leg, he brings him over the inner rope. Right here is when the title is going to change right here. You know, he's already the U.S. heavyweight champion, and now he's going to be the television champion. What do you think according, to, according to uh, Speed Manson, he wants Pez Watley to have every belt there is. Now, he does. There's no doubt about it. Pez Watley is the United States heavyweight champion. And, and uh, Speed Manson has predicted that he's going to be the TV title uh, title holder also. You know, I don't see anybody out here uh, There's a side. any challenges, man, to any. My man, Pistol Pez, he's standing right there. He's looking good, man. You're talking 230 pounds of muscle, man. Look at him right there showing his strength, man. Watch it like uh Oh, what? there's a hair pull. I didn't they pull the hair. That looked like weak strength to me, man. Leaping Lanny ready to throw a punch, and you can't blame him for that, regardless of what Speed Manson says. There's a go behind by Les Wally. And Leaping Lanny brings him over, and he gets away, and he's like, he tops him. Now Leaping Lanny has the advantage, and Pez Wally, Pez Wally goes to the ropes immediately. The fireman's carry brings him over, and Watley is on the mat. It wasn't an excellent fireman's carry, though, Sam. I've seen a lot of mistakes in that. Whether you're hearing an opinion from uh, Speed Manson, who does no wrestling, and he does have some good men. But we don't I mean I do no wrestling, Sam Minnicker. I'm a fine wrestler in my own right, you know. I could beat a lot of people, you know, maybe Randy Savage, Leaping Lanny. Maybe they like to wrestle me one time, you know. I don't see him anywhere. I think Randy Savage is scared of me. You're hearing from Speed Manson, the manager of Pez Wally, and he has an exalted opinion of himself. Now, the fact remains that he does manage some good men, such as Pez Wadley, who, of course, is the United States champion. And uh, 
We cannot condone his uh, actions, however, the actions of Speed Manson. Don't you worry about it. Leaping Lanny with a side headlock, he climbs those ropes, he crashes, he crashes Pez Watley to the mat. The referee watching the... Why not this Bruce Spring, Sam? Why don't you let me talk for a minute, Sam? Minute? I'm trying to do something here and explain to you the way things are, man. You know, Pez Watley, I got the defiant ones, the animal. He, you know, that man's totally insane, man. And I like that, though, because I can control him. I'm the only one that can control him, but we have to control him away from these people that are scared by Leaping Lanny and Randy Savage. And Sam uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'd just like to say too, that... Uh, Randy Savage and the Leaping Lanny and the wrestlers that uh, Speed Manson talked about have no fear of the animal, the defiant ones, Pez Wally or anyone. America, where are these people then? Where, where is right Randy now Savage? it's I don't see Randy right now is a side headlock by Leaping Lanny. Uh, Pez Wally pulls his hair. Pez Wally, of course, is known as the Royal Master. The Royal Master. There's a little word of advice, a council of war by Speed Manson talking with Pez Wadley. Side headlock, very well applied on Leaping Lanny. I would like to explain, uh, fans, the reason that Speed Manson is always at ringside when his men are wrestling. He is contractually, he has signed, and the, the promoters are contractually obligated to allow him to be at ringside. Oh, beautiful move by Leaping Lanny. And he crashed wildly to the mat. Oh, look at that backflip by Leaping Lanny, a tremendous gymnast. A magnificent athlete. And Watley seek, seeks refuge on the outside. Now he's getting back in there. Pez Watley is very rough and tough, but he has a tremendous physique. Both these wrestlers are finely conditioned, looking really good in there. Pez Watley, very rough, as you can see. Oh, man! Speed Manson struck... Struck him on, struck Lanny on the head with that belt. Hey, you didn't see me do anything, man. I've been standing here talking to you, Sam Miniker. Fans, regardless of what Manson said, you saw it as I did. He hit him on the head with that belt. The referee did not, did not see that. How much time here, Sam Miniker, for Ben Watley to win that TV title, man? It's a 15-minute time limit match. Right now, Pez Watley seems... Oh, man! He seems to be the aggressor at this point. He crushed the head of Lanny into the turnbuckle. Again, he crashes the head into the turnbuckle. A punch in the midsection by Leaping Lanny. And he drove that fist into the midsection. He does so again. And Watley's in trouble. Oh, a beautiful drop kick. <laughs> Leaping Lanny has him covered, but Watley has a foot on the outside, and that means an automatic break. being harassed on the outside by He's right there. He got some by Speed Manson. Right now, Lanny in trouble as he's thrown through the ropes. He floor and hits it hard. Oh, a vicious kick by Speed Manson. I don't know how we're going to control this man on the outside. We may. He's getting back up in the ring. Pierce, get on him, baby. You know what to do with him now. Leaping Lanny, kick to the head. And right now it looks as if Pez Watley is way out in front, but Leaping Lanny is in there in a hurry. He's punched in the midsection, dropped to the mat. Man 
Hudson is talking to the referee, diverting his attention. And as he does so, Lanny is thrown out of the ring over the top rope. Referring with the referee about the bad call that he made, Sam Minister. And that's all he's doing, man. And now what is the referee saying? I don't give a shit. I'm going to do everything in my power to keep you away from ringside. I want you to know that. Into the ropes. A rolling reverse cradle hold. A two count, and he got away. A beautiful maneuver by Leaping Lanny. A punch to the chin. Leaping Lanny. Works him over really well. Getting his medals here. They're so many this way right. And the referee. Head to the ropes. A ball. What a backdrop. Way out of way up there. And one. And now he's got him covered. A two count. But once again. That's you. What? Your head right there, Sam Minica. That's you in your head. Once again, he had the foot on the ropes. And of course, that means an automatic break. Any part of the body. In the ropes or under the ropes or on the ropes, that means an automatic break. Listen there, right there. You see here as well, he's getting back in the face battle. How much more time left in this TV title here, Sam Minnicker? Right now, it's Leaping Lanny. Ready, Pez Watley, back in the corner, backing away. Watley with a headbutt. He drives his head into the forehead of Leaping Lanny. He threw him into that corner. Oh, man, what a nice takedown. A flying toe hold by Leaping Lanny. A punch in the chin. He's got him covered. He can't quite hold him down, but he's wearing him down slowly but surely. A front headlock, but they're in the ropes. On the break, a punch in the midsection. Now he's standing on the throat, pressing his foot on the throat. He brought him over. What a tremendous match here by Leaping Lanny. A big body slam. And Watley's on the mat. And he's up climbing that top rope. Uh, oh, what a terrific maneuver. One, two, and three. And it's all over. And retaining, retaining the TV title is Leaping Lanny. Leaping Lanny has done it again. He's retained that TV title. And regardless of the protest of Speed Manson, the winner and still TV champion is none other than Leaping Lanny. Well, ladies and gentlemen, a great match, a great victory, and we'll be back in a moment, so please stand by.